Welcome back to more Gears Tactics. I'm not sure exactly if we're going to be able to do both missions and if we're going to win both missions. I wonder what happens when we lose a mission. Do we lose that actual person we play with? Um, I would like to use Cole, but I don't know what happens when we lose a unit. That's the only thing. Let's take Cole. End of story, baby. Got intel on a pair of grub torture pods located in a fortified enemy position. Crack them open and evacuate those prisoners. All right, my damage is increased by 20%. Let's hope that's gonna be enough. Wow, okay, big crate there. I don't know if that's a crate we can loot or not. Okay, so we're not really gonna be alone. On my way. Look what we got here. Whoa, the one to move. Okay. And we got a sniper unit coming in. I'm not so sure I can deal with all that. <laughs> Enemies within 10 meters are removed from cover and interrupted. Won't trigger Overwatch. Oh yeah, you ain't got that for the crane, yes. baby. Yes. On my way. Here they come! Okay, that was really bad. A sniper can't reach us, which is good. Wake up, baby! Yeah, we're gonna get shot at again. Let's go for it. There we go, nice. Did you see that? Lock and load! And hopefully we're safe enough here for the sniper not to be able to hit us. Nice. Okay, this guy is getting very close. We have to be careful about that. We're going to need to rush uh, to get up here now to this unit. Okay, let's do that. Or I could just go overwatch on him. That probably would work just as well. Oh yeah, I got enough for all of y'all. Sniper. They nice, he missed. He can't reach us. Ah, here we go again. Get the extra AP, which is really good for the other unit. Okay, that's where we have to go. I'm not sure we're gonna be able to save both. About damn time. Okay, we could go with one unit all the way through in stealth and just open it. Which is this bridge here. And could try to outrun the others. Okay. So basically, we're just out running. I'm gonna ignore this crate. Um, actually, it might be good. No, 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 no. It's too close. We're gonna leave this crate. It's too risky. Let's make it happen. Yeah, here, catch this. Can't stop this. On my way. Setting up here. Ready. Ooh, okay, we have snipers here. That might have been a bad idea. Ah, oh, that is bad. He gets a shot off. No, Overwatch. Okay, that's that's okay. Think you big, huh? You got nothing on me, baby. 
if we go here, we have two. And then I can throw a grenade at him. Let's do it. Moving! Nice. Vanguard or heavy? <sighs> have to return to the vehicle. Yep, that's pretty much what I thought we we're gonna have to do. Frag out! There we go, nice. Stay down. Let's pick up the chest. It's on the way, might good. as well. <laughs> okay, that's okay, that's okay. He's attacking Cole, that's fine. Gonna overwatch as well, which is not good. Oh my god, we're gonna have oh it's only one unit. I thought we we're gonna get a whole bunch of units, so Okay, that's okay. Oh, wow, okay, more of them. I know we're gonna get hit, but we have to. There we go. Reloading now! So thank! Now you're Heal a target LF for 100 health at the end of your turn for 3 turns. Won't trigger Overwatch. That is really, really good. So we can put that actually on Cole. Oh, do we have to stand right beside them? Okay, then just heal. Here, this will help. There we go. Let's head down here and then Overwatch Let's on. Because I think we're gonna have some guys coming in from there. Eyes peeled. Nice. And stay down. Okay, we have this guy coming in. We have another unit coming in from there as well. So Cole is going to have to come in as quickly as possible now. This unit throws a proximity mine that plants into the ground. The mine will detonate when an enemy moves into its radius. This unit cannot deploy more than two mines. Okay, so let's see. Here, catch! Setting up a perimeter. Here we go! Okay, we get hit once, that's fine. Rex is on me. Okay, we get hit as well once. Uh, Rex is on me. There we go, nice. Boom! Nice work, baby. Okay. Here we go! Come here! Okay, that was unexpected. Gonna reload. Two for one. Go ahead. And do a reload. Yeah, we're not reload. gonna do that in less than three turns. Ready. Taking position. Eyes peeled. Nice. Beautiful. Nice partial hit. Solid copy. I see the objective. How do you miss a shot from that range? That is just absolutely insanity. Seven percent chance. Let's do it. There we go. Nice. Excellent. Okay. That's okay. Cole is a tough cookie. Understood. 
Got the extra AP for the other two, so hopefully we can move everybody in. Keep on coming. Complete the mission in one turn or less. That's it. I, I, I'm literally short right now. Just this one little thing. So if I wouldn't have executed him, maybe, but... Oh man, that's it. I think we lost the spe the extra objective. Unless the next turn counts. If this turn counts, then we still made the objective. Scout reporting in. Let's see if we made it. I don't know if it counts. We'll see. We got the epic armor. We didn't get to complete the mission. Ah, we got we didn't get the extra rare case, but look at that. We got epic hunter shell, 10 evasion. That's gonna go on Spectre. Cole is now level four, which is very nice. So we can swap him out with Sid, I suppose, every now and then. Right now we don't need him because he already leveled up. Midnight stock, hair trigger, and plus 30 damage. Okay, that's probably for the shotgun. We have a look. Okay, we're gonna have two points with Cole. Um Passive skill, when this unit gets critically hit on an enemy, that enemy receives the bleed status effect. Units with bleed effect receive 200 damage at the beginning of the next three turns. That is going to be very handy. We're going to take that. Thank you very much. And Avenger, when an ally takes damage, this unit gets plus 25% damage for this turn to a maximum of four stacks. When an ally is down, this unit gets plus one action point. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see if we have an improvement for Spectre. Um, I think we can put the epic armor on her. Yeah, look at this. Oh, no, it puts health down to zero. Ooh, that is not good because we want the extra health. So let's see what we have for Sid. For Sid. Okay, crit chance is lowered, but we get hair trigger. When this unit uses a shot ability, it gets a 10% chance to shoot the same target again. That's actually really good. I think that's worth 5% crit chance. So I think the Epic Hunter will come in here because we currently have equipped um, Onyx Shell, which Damage is increased by 7%, but 5 evasion, but here we go to 10 evasion, and when this unit executes an enemy, each ally healed for 15% maximum health, which is really, really nice, um, because she would be in the back, she wouldn't be much hurt anyway, and she could help heal the people in the front line, so I think that would be worth it. 